Hey, what is up guys? Jin and Gaming over here. Today I'm going to be showing my best class setup for the MP11. The personal variant I like to use is the squeaker. The reason why I like the squeaker is because of its crazy rate of fire and pretty much completely fixable flaws. What I mean by this is, as you can see, it has plus two fire rate and minus two accuracy. What I like to do is I like slapping on a laser sight because it fixes that accuracy problem like no problem. And also with crazy firing SMGs, you gotta slap on a foregrip to pretty much fix the handling. And so that pretty much fixes the whole gun to make it perfect for anyone who likes a fast rate, low recoil gun. For secondaries, I like to use the RW1, specifically the Holiday, because of its range. It has flaws in accuracy, but it's only one, it's not that big of a deal, it's barely noticeable. For perks, I like going with Low Profile, Blind Eye, Gung Ho, Toughness, and Blast Suppressor. These two perks are pretty much the most important, because Gung Ho, while I have that laser sight on, I'm able to run around without putting my gun down and being able to shoot anybody I see with no distractions. Blind Eye keeps me off the radar so no one really sees me, no killstreaks see me except the UAV, and it's just pretty much perfect. And there's always one little free spot. I like slapping on a Semtex, but if you want, you can put an Exo ability, you can put a score streak, you can put anything you want. Now here's what I mean by the fast rate of fire. It chomps through the magazine. But look, I'm going to show you guys it at long range as you can see it does not hold up pretty well let's shoot another magazine second time it held a little better now let's try mid range did a lot better Let's try that again without our other shots in there. So mid-range, pretty much almost every bullet hits, and occasional other bullets don't hit. But I think it's still amazing at mid-range. Now let's try that one more time at mid-range. You get a perfect 91, and close range is just ridiculous. And now look what I mean by hit firing with this gun. pretty much shoots perfectly. And that pretty much wraps it up for this video. This is my best setup for the MP11, and of course if you do not have this gun, please hunt for it because I completely recommend it 100%. I actually have a game of me using this gun and it makes me do way better than I normally do because I am not too good at this game but with this gun I'm pretty decent. The next gun I'm gonna cover is the BAL 27 308. Now this is the class setup but I'm not gonna explain anything yet until the next video so I'll see you guys in the next one.